actually remember what it was I ate that day to blow me up to that extreme. It wasn't diet soda, by the way. That was just a joke for a friend. But it was happening a couple of times a week. It was getting really irritating because you don't want to do anything when you look eight months pregnant. You, like, you, it hurts to hold your stomach in. And, like, it's just, it's just, like, no, it's wrong. Something's wrong. So I got a allergy test done, um, Life Labs uh, in the UK. They were kind enough to send me a free test and I got tons of things tested. I'm gonna show you my results, hang on. The test that they sent me, it was the complete body one, which is their most comprehensive one. And then they send you a massive report on all the items that they've tested for. And they tell you how allergic or reactive you are to them. And guys, there was so much stuff that I had some form of reaction to. It was, it was genuinely ridiculous. I got my results back. I cut out every single one of those ingredients for a solid four weeks. And you guys, I'm not gonna lie. Best four weeks of my entire adult life. I had the energy levels of a two-year-old child. I had the skin of a four-year-old child. I had the mental clarity of a six-year-old. They might not be that mentally clear, but I had, I had it all for four weeks. It was divine, incredible. However, these revelations are not without their downsides. I have found out. I'm intolerant to pretty much everything I like. I can't drink no milk. Can't eat no eggs, can't have no cheese. Well, I'm still in the testing phase right now to see which of these ingredients are actually the culprit and which ones are just a false positive. But you guys, so far, milk Sonoto, my favorite white beverage. Eggs are Sonoto, my favorite white circular food. <laughs> Kinda sucks, but at least now I know. So if I wanna feel like crap, I can feel like crap. And that's my choice. And it's not just something that's happened to me on a random Tuesday when I want to look good, damn it.